So over the last few weeks, I've been working on a new website um, for a big client that I've sealed months ago. It's a part of, I did a branding for them. Now I'm working on a website, then app and some print assets. I've started the, the web project last week by doing kind of a strategic meeting with them. In that meeting, I really tried to understand what are they looking for in a website? What is the content that is important to them? Uh, so that I could get started on doing some wireframes, building content. I'll be writing the content myself before I'm doing the design and then development. I'll develop it. Uh, for them on Webflow. So during that meeting, I really asked them how does uh, a typical sales meeting goes because the way that they sell in a face-to-face -face meeting, the way that they're doing their presentation is probably the way that we should structure our homepage because the homepage in a website, especially it's a corporate website, it's it's a kind of company in the, in the um, transportation industry. So the way that the homepage is structured is kind of like a sales sales meeting you know either trying to convince you um in a certain flow so during that meeting i kind of tried to understand that and then i i started doing some wireframes myself so usually I, I do sketches in my notebook for the wireframes and i don't actually usually do wireframes on the computer straight i have them here for kind of my uh purposes of understanding how to do the design and then i go straight to sketch and do the design but in this case I wanted to share the, the wireframes with them to see that I've actually understood the kind of the flow of the content straight and I wanted them to help me write the content um, before I actually put the design into it because I think that once you have the final text, the true text, it's much easier to do good design uh, that you know communicates that. So I was wondering a lot how I should do that. I used to use a, a tool called Mockingbird for wireframing and, and collaboration, but I didn't want to go in, in, into that again. And I, I also thought about maybe starting to do the wireframes in Sketch and then sharing it over with them on Envision, try to communicate using the, the comments. But I really wanted a super simple solution so that they could, you know, without creating accounts or so, could just edit and, and the text you know freely and easily so at the end after you know uh, asking a few friends what they're doing I actually came to the conclusion that I should perhaps be using uh, one of the Google apps and actually Google drawing is not a bad product to do that so check out this is basically what I did this is uh, obviously without the the final text but just so you see how that looks like you know I, I just draw it here with rectangulars and uh, and shapes uh, but then I can really easily share it with them. They don't have to ha open an account. You know, everybody has a, a Google account and they could straight um, edit the text right here. So this is really easy for collaboration. Basically, the flow goes something like uh, we start with the vision on the header, then talking about the benefits and some uh, partners logo for some social proof, um, then talking about the markets that we're targeting, um, talking about how, how we do this, and then kind of a contact and, and a footer. So that's basically the structure of the homepage. There are several other pages here. Today I have the meeting where I'm going to go and present this over to them, see that it works fine, and then I'll actually share it with them so we can collaborate on the content. So right now I have to go to a different client meeting, work with the designer over there for a little session, and then head over to that wireframing meeting. Hope it'll be successful. Right, pretty good design session so far. Heading out to my other client, present the wireframes. I'm excited to hear what they think about it. place pretty extreme I would say pretty challenging ride but I'm right on time 
right that was a super super long meeting it was planned to be an hour and a half turned out over two hours so I'm super late home for for the wife and kids overall it went okay I can't say that it went great I got a lot of rejects for the text that I wrote which is okay after all that's why I kind of wanted to share the wireframes with them and do it on the Google Doc so they can collaborate on that with me but um, I don't know I thought I did a good job and I also used a copywriter friend to help me write the text but they had a lot of rejects on that basically the content and structure they approved it and we're gonna move into the design section but I don't know just didn't feel like wow that was amazing felt like okay yeah let's proceed so I'm gonna be working on that on the design for like a week and a half now it's pretty tight uh, but I'm gonna try to do a good job and then present the design to them and uh, in the meanwhile keep working on the text collaboratively Anyway, that's all for today guys and it's the weekend so I will catch you next week.